Oxford Read and Imagine, Level Two. Plunk's new job, by Paul Shipton, read by Mandy Weston. Published and copyright Oxford University Press, 2015. Hello, my name is Ben. Hello, my name is Rosie. This is Grandpa. This is Grandpa's van. It's fantastic. Ben, Rosie's brother. Rosie, Ben's sister. Grandpa. Clunk, Grandpa's robot. Gordon, a chef. Jen, a chef. Now let's read this story, Clunk's new job. Grandpa is fixing the van today. Ben and Rosie are helping him. When Clunk comes out, he asks, "What are you doing, Grandpa? How can I help?" Can you make me a cup of tea, please? asks Grandpa. Clunk takes a cup of tea. To Grandpa. Here you are, he says. But Clunk drops the cup, and tea goes in the engine. Lots of smoke comes from the van. Oh no! Rosie says. Sorry, says Clunk. He runs to the house. Ben and Rosie go and look for Clunk. They can't find him, but Rosie finds a letter from Clunk. She reads it to Ben. Grandpa doesn't want my help. But I want to work. I want to get a job in town. Let's tell Grandpa," says Ben. In town, Clunk thinks, "What job can I do? Do I want to work in an office, or maybe in a store?" Then he sees a sign in a restaurant window. Job. We want a new chef. Fantastic, he says. I can work here. Gordon the chef opens the door and sees Clunk. Who are you? Gordon asks. I'm Clunk, says the robot. I want to work here, please. Gordon isn't sure, but his restaurant is very busy today. Okay, he says. Jen works in the restaurant too. She gives Clunk a tall chef's hat. Thank you," says Clunk. Clunk, cook this chicken, please," says Gordon. Fast. That's easy," says Clunk. I can cook it very fast. But. Soon, 
there's lots of smoke. Oh dear, says Jen. We don't want the firefighters to come here. When he sees the chicken, Gordon is angry. You can't work here. Go. But Jen says, Wait, maybe he can be a waiter. Fantastic, Clunk says. But what's a waiter? Waiters carry plates of food to the tables, says Jen. How many plates can you carry, Clunk? Two? Three? Clunk puts out his arms. They get longer and longer. I can carry lots of plates, says Clunk. Wow, says Jen. At home, Ben and Rosie take Clunk's letter to Grandpa. Is Clunk okay? asks Rosie. I'm not sure, says Grandpa. He opens the van door. Let's go to town and find him, he says. Come on, Ben and Rosie. Grandpa drives to town. What's that noise? asks Ben. Is it coming from the engine? It's getting louder. Rosie looks out the window. The wheels aren't on the street, she says. We're flying. Oh dear, says Grandpa. We don't want to do that. In the restaurant, Clunk is busy with his new job. Waiter, says a woman at one table. This is the wrong food. I want rice, not potatoes. Okay, says Clunk. Sorry. And I want fish, not pizza, says a man next to the window. Clunk doesn't move. Go to the kitchen and get my fish now, says the man. Be quiet, please says Clunk. Eat your pizza. It's nice. He looks at the street outside. He listens. I can hear Grandpa's van, he says. Rosie and Ben are scared. What's wrong with the van? Rosie asks. I don't know, says Grandpa. I can't take it down. Maybe Clunk can hear us, says Ben. He opens a window and shouts, Clunk, help! Clunk is on the street now. I'm coming, he shouts. Clunk is fast. He puts his long arms on the van. Then he pulls the van down to the street. Well done, Clunk, says Grandpa. The children Open the door. 
Thank you, Clunk, they say. Grandpa and the children go to the restaurant with Clunk. Gordon is very angry. You can't work here, he tells Clunk. That's okay, says Grandpa. Clunk isn't a waiter or a chef. I want him at home with me. Clunk's happy when he hears that. We can fix the van later, says Grandpa. Let's have some lunch. What's good here? asks Ben. The man next to the window says to Clunk, You were right. The pizza is nice. Let's have pizza, says Grandpa. And I'd like a cup of tea, please. <laughs> Picture Dictionary Carry Chef Chicken Cook Cup Down Drop Engine Firefighter Fish Fix Food Kitchen Letter Man Noise Office Pizza Plate Potatoes Pull Restaurant Rice Robot Shout Sign Smoke Store Waiter Wheel Window Woman